Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Salisa Tropical Fruit Tree. Just want to update my white sapori in the ground. I have four all of them, but today I just show you the three one at the front here. But the little I put in the middle of the winter. But look at it guys, how small is that? Like around 40 cm or 30 cm is very short and small. And now look at the new girl guys. So this is my um, lemon girl. It grows amazing. So that's so beautiful and very nice tree. Growing everywhere and the little lumps coming again. See the little one dot there? Yeah, so beautiful. They grow very fast guys. And this tree is a white supported lemon girl. They are very very easy to grow in Melbourne. If you want to grow lemon go, you know, if you want to grow a white sapore, you should grow guy. It's too easy to grow. That's what I found and I put them in the middle of winter. And now look at this. It's amazing, isn't it? If you want to see how it looks like, you can go to my old video. I posted before, yeah. It's nothing. So this all is new grow. This only. So this is my lemon go. It's about two months or two and a half months in the ground. Or probably three months, yeah, because I put in the middle of winter, around maybe August, sorry, yeah, in the middle of winter, yeah, so around August. And that's my lemon go. And the my kampong, it's very slow grow, guys. Yeah, a little bit slow, but it's coming. Hello, it's a new grow. See that? And this one, too. Yeah, but they're coming. They're very strong tree, guys. This one, like, look how tall it is. <laughs> Maybe five inch tall, not even thirty centimeter tall, right? But they can handle with a cold, with a frost, with a hot. So it's very good. White sapori, and they taste amazing. I love white white sapori. <laughs> so that's my kampong and this my three in the ground look at that guy beautiful beautiful isn't it so this one is a uh, wilson this that my wilson is about 30 centimeter tall and god look at new growth everywhere if you want to plant tropical fruit tree this is the first one you have to do i mean you have to start with not much take care at all but before you plant you have to use a good soil you have to use the premium uh, premium potting me i got them from bunning and i don't even give them a seaweed proper maybe once a month seaweed because seaweed is very good what i found out is helping the root grow and then protect from the root um frost so very good so this is my Wilson look the new girl guy was a beautiful tree and super easy to grow yeah yeah if you really want to plant tropical fruit tree season number one easy to go with no much not much look after not much take care just put in the ground and then just give them once a week water that's it but when summertime, maybe you have to kill them every day. But because winter time, I get them once a week, two, two week one time. Yeah. So that's my version, and this is my uh, kampong, and that is my lemon go. So all grow and doing so well. <laughs> All right, guys, and I have one more. It's a suit belt at the back. Yeah, but I already locked the door or the gate, so I have to go to work. So I will film for you the next time, and the fruit getting a lot bigger too. The one my suit belt at the back. All right, guys, thanks so much for your likes my channel and watching my video. And if you very want my channel keep going, please give me a thumbs up share and subscribe then make me feel better to keep 
going my video to show you guys, you know, how my tree going and especially I would like to show you, I would like to show everyone in Melbourne, you know, we live in a very cold weather and I would like to show how we can growing tropical fruit in Melbourne. So if you still want to see my channel and my video keep going, please help me like, share and subscribe and I'm very thankful to everyone. Alright guys, i see you my next video and thank you so much again. <laughs> Alright guys, bye bye.